In an era where the pixels were plenty and the adventures boundless, one game stood out as a testament to the magic of exploration and fantasy on the Nintendo Entertainment System. Today, we're dusting off a cartridge that merged the realms of RPG and platformer in an unforgettable way. This is the story of Fossa Nudu. Released as part of the Dragon Slayer series, a saga less known in the West, but revered by those in the know, Fahaza Nudu was a unique blend of action, adventure, and role-playing that captivated gamers worldwide. With its intricate world design, challenging gameplay, and a hauntingly beautiful soundtrack, it carved a niche in the hearts of those who embarked on its epic quest. Fahaza Nudu, a portmanteau of Famicom and Xanadu, was more than just a game. It was a journey into the heart of the mysterious world tree, a place teeming with danger, magic, and mystery. Players took on the role of an unnamed hero, returning to his homeland, only to find it besieged by a malevolent force. What followed was an epic quest to restore balance and harmony, a journey that would take players through sprawling forests, daunting dungeons, and insformidable foes. In this series, we'll uncover the magic of Fasanudu, exploring every nook and cranny of its pixel-perfect world. From the game mechanics that challenged and rewarded in equal measure, to the story and characters that made this journey unforgettable, we're diving deep into what makes Fasanudu a true classic of the NES era. In the heart of our journey through Fasanudu lies a story woven with the threads of fantasy, peril, and discovery. A tale set against the backdrop of the once majestic world tree, a colossal organism whose roots and branches house entire civilizations and dark, forgotten places. Our saga begins with a nameless hero, a wanderer returning to his homeland after an arduous journey, only to find it enveloped in a miasma of despair and decay. The once vibrant towns and lush landscapes are now overrun with hostile creatures, a corruption emanating from the tree itself. The king, a figure both wise and weary, informs our hero of the dire situation. The elves and dwarves, once peaceful neighbors within the branches of the world tree, are now foes, torn apart by the spread of a malevolent force. The source of this evil? The meteorite that struck the tree, poisoning its very essence and giving rise to monstrous beings, tasked with an epic quest to ascend the world tree from its drought-stricken roots to its highest branches, our hero must gather the mystical items and knowledge needed to vanquish the evil at the tree's heart. Along the way, the lines between friend and foe blur, as the hero encounters characters both benevolent and malevolent, each with their own tales of suffering and hope. The journey is arduous, filled with trials that test the hero's resolve, strength, and wisdom. From the parched roots where water is but a memory, through the trunk riddled with dungeons and caverns, to the uppermost branches where the air itself holds the promise of finality and renewal. Our hero perseveres. Each step forward unveils a piece of the larger puzzle. The corruption, the strife among the tree's denizens, and the hero's own destiny are intertwined in a narrative that transcends the bounds of traditional storytelling in gaming. Faza Nudu doesn't just tell a story. It invites players to live it breathe it, and ultimately shape the outcome of this epic tale. Beneath the surface of Fasanudu's epic tale lies a gameplay experience that is both richly rewarding and fiendishly challenging. At the intersection of action RPG and platforming elements, Fasanudu carved its own niche in the gaming landscape of the NES era. Players take control of the unnamed hero, wielding swords, magic spells, and an array of equipment to navigate the perils of the world tree. Combat is straightforward, yet requires precision, as enemies possess varied patterns and weaknesses. The game encourages exploration and strategy, rewarding those who take the time to master its nuances. Unlike traditional RPGs of its time, Fasa Nudu incorporates a real-time combat system that blends seamlessly with platforming challenges. This combination requires players to not only fight with skill, but also move with purpose precision jumping, timing attacks, and utilizing the right gear for the right situation become second nature on this journey. Resource management is another cornerstone of Fasa Nudu's gameplay. Gold and experience are gained from defeating enemies, but it's the game's currency, gold, that adds a layer of depth to the adventure. 
players must judiciously spend their hard-earned gold on items, weapons, and crucially, health and magic potions. Character progression in Fahazanudo is both rewarding and strategic. As players defeat enemies and accumulate experience, they can visit Guru characters to level up, enhancing their hit points and magic. Each level not only increases the hero's strength and durability, but also unlocks access to new areas and gear, ensuring that progression feels meaningful and impactful. Exploration is rewarded with secrets and shortcuts hidden throughout the world tree. From hidden rooms filled with treasures to elusive merchants selling powerful gear, the game is riddled with secrets, waiting to be uncovered by the most dedicated adventurers. And then there are the bosses, monumental tests of everything players have learned. Each boss challenges the player in unique ways, demanding a combination of quick reflexes, strategic use of items and spells, and a deep understanding of the game's mechanics. Defeating them is not just a matter of brute force, but of intellect and perseverance. Falzanudu's gameplay is a masterclass in blending genres, offering a richly satisfying and challenging experience that stands the test of time. It's a game that demands patience, rewards diligence, and inspires awe with its depth and complexity. Every legendary journey is accompanied by a score that echoes its triumphs, trials, and the transformation of its hero. In Fazanudu, the music and sound effects are not just background elements. They are integral to the fabric of the game, weaving a rich tapestry that enhances every step of the adventure within the world tree. Composed with the limited but surprisingly versatile sound chip of the NES, Fazanudu's soundtrack stands out for its haunting melodies and rhythmic beats. From the moment the title screen fades in, players are greeted with a theme that is both ominous and inviting, setting the tone for the journey ahead. As our hero traverses the diverse environments of the world tree, from its desolate roots to its branches teeming with life, the music shifts to reflect each area's unique ambience and challenges. The melodies adapt, fostering a sense of wonder, tension, or determination that perfectly matches the visuals on screen. Even in moments of respite, such as visiting towns or speaking with NPCs, the music plays a crucial role. Each location has its own distinct sound, from the mystical tunes of the Guru's temples to the lively yet somehow melancholic melodies of the game's various shops and inns. These compositions enhance the storytelling, enriching the game's world and imbuing it with depth and character. It's not just the music that stands out in Fasa Nudu. The sound effects also play a pivotal role in the gaming experience. The clash of sword against foe, the sound of magic spells being cast, and the distinctive noise of collecting items create an auditory feedback loop that is both satisfying and informative to the player. Imagine for a moment this world without its music and sound. The silence underscores how integral the soundtrack is to the full Fasa Nudu experience. It's the music that breathes life into the hero's journey, transforming each step, jump, and battle into a moment worth savoring. As the pixels fade and the music dims, the legacy of Fasanudu continues to resonate through the corridors of gaming history. In a realm where countless titles vie for the attention of players, Faxanadu stands tall as a testament to the power of innovation, storytelling, and immersive gameplay. But what exactly is the legacy of this NES classic, and how has it influenced the gaming landscape we know today? To the community of retro gamers and enthusiasts, Fasa Nudu is more than just a game. It's a cherished memory, a symbol of the golden age of gaming. Its unique blend of RPG elements with platforming action has inspired a loyal following, with players and developers alike drawing inspiration from its innovative mechanics and captivating world. Developers have noted Fazanudu's influence on the evolution of action RPGs. Its seamless integration of story and gameplay, alongside a dynamic world filled with mystery and adventure, has served as a blueprint for modern titles seeking to blend genres and create immersive experiences. Games today owe a debt to pioneers like Fazanudu. Its DNA can be seen in the way games are structured, in the importance of storytelling, and in the fusion of gameplay mechanics that challenge and engage players in new and exciting ways. While Fauza Nudu has not seen a modern remake or sequel, its spirit lives on through fan remakes, 
tributes and the preservation efforts of the retro gaming community. These endeavors ensure that new generations of gamers can experience this classic title, understanding its place in the pantheon of gaming greats. From the humble beginnings at the foot of the world tree to the epic climax against the forces of darkness, our journey through Fasa Nudu has been a reminder of the magic that video games can offer. We've battled foes, explored mysterious lands, and uncovered ancient secrets, all within the confines of our beloved NAS. Through our exploration, we've seen how Faza Nudu set the stage for many of the gaming mechanics and narrative techniques we take for granted today. Its blend of action, adventure, and RPG elements was ahead of its time, influencing countless games that followed. But more importantly, we've seen how Faza Nudu continues to live on in the hearts of gamers. Through community events, fan art, and the endless quest to speedrun and rediscover every secret, Faxanadu's spirit remains unbroken, a testament to its enduring appeal. As we bid farewell to the mystical world of Fasanudu, let's not forget the importance of preserving these classic games. They are not just relics of the past, but milestones in the evolution of gaming, offering lessons, inspiration, and endless enjoyment to new generations of gamers. If you've never experienced Fasanudu, I encourage you to dust off your NOAS, fire up that emulator, or find any means to embark on this journey. For those who have walked the World Tree's branches before, maybe it's time to revisit and relive the adventure anew. Share your stories, your triumphs, and your trials in the comments below. Let's keep the conversation going and the memories alive. And as always, if you enjoyed this deep dive into the world of retro gaming, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell for more adventures into the pixelated past. Thank you for joining me on this journey through Fasa Nudu. Until our next retro gaming adventure, keep exploring, keep dreaming, and above all, keep playing. This is Mighty Retro, signing off.